Happening in Greenville today, ECU and Vina join forces to combine their physicians' practices. WNCT's Brandon Truitt live now with the latest details. Brandon. Ken, good evening to you. Yeah, big news coming out of Vidant Health and ECU today as they sign a merger that will affect thousands of people in the East. ECU uh, physicians and Vidant Medical Group will now merge under one name. Now, Vidant CEO Michael Waldrop says it will take some time for this to happen and it'll happen gradually over the next couple of years. Waldrop says patients of both organizations will now have more locations in which they can seek services and he expects Medicare costs will ultimately go down as a result of these shared resources. ECU Chancellor Cecil Staten uh, says students of Brody School of Medicine uh, will ultimately benefit from this. Staten says this merger will allow for students of the Brody School of Medicine more opportunities to complete their clinical requirements locally. So as we grow our enrollment, we look to what wonderful advantages will be there for our students because it is the practice plan that is the primary uh, vehicle for providing that clinical experience and teaching for our medical students. As part of the agreement, Vidant will make an initial $34 million payment to ECU and an annual $14.45 million uh, support payment to the Brody School of Medicine for the next 30 years. Now, this is an, a major announcement that has affected thousands or will ultimately affect thousands of people throughout the East. They expect full rollout of this merger to happen starting in 2018. Live in Greenville, Brandon Truitt, 9 on your side.